To me, AVID is. To me, AVID is a support system. AVID is accountability. AVID is a community. To me, AVID is a family culture that I'm very thankful to be a part of. To me, AVID is a community, a family, a place for kids to go belong. When I was overwhelmed with coursework, AVID helped me stay organized. When I was overwhelmed emotionally, my friends and teachers and AVID helped me out. Not only has it made me a better student, but I've also created lasting impressions and relationships with my teachers and peers. When I first joined AVID, I was not involved in high school, and AVID made me feel more comfortable joining other clubs. And with these other clubs, I was able to qualify for scholarships to get me into college. It's not only helped me learn to time manage with my school, work, and sports, but it's also helped teach me to be accountable for not only myself, but others. And I know if something went wrong, the AVID community was there to help get me back on track towards success. AVID is the support system that I never knew I needed. To me, AVID is student-centered family-oriented, driven by amazing teachers who empower our students to take ownership of their learning and prepare them for college. To me, AVID is exactly what a student like me could have used when I was in high school. Welcome, future Titans and parents. My name is Carrie Davis, and I'm the AVID administrator here at Legend. We are excited for you to explore the AVID program. Hello, my name is Nick Ryder, and I am the 10th and 12th grade AVID elective teacher here at Legend High School. Often people ask me what AVID is. AVID stands for Advancement Via Individual Determination. To me, AVID is a place where kids come to get college and career ready. We provide structural support and organization tools, time management, all the while working on our critical thinking. AVID is really about learning how to learn. That includes organization, that includes goal setting, that includes note taking, organizing information, it includes collaborating. There's so many moving pieces to being a learner and AVID breaks down, all right, I'm gonna help you get good at this strategy as a learner. Let's help you make it yours, but this is a proven practice. Just knowing and understanding that we're trying to do what's best for all students within the AVID program. Knowing that a student can take an honors class or an AP class, that's the one way that they're gonna know if they're gonna be ready for college or not. It's because it's the pacing, it's the amount of reading, it's the amount of homework, because when you get to college, you don't have that safety net. And here at Legend High School, we create that for the students if they do happen to struggle. In AVID, we go through our entire day in a very organized fashion. That just going to a class and doing your work and then drop that class and go to the next class. It's emphasizing how we tie all of our classes together and how we use our planners in each class and we have, I mean, these binders to organize all of our classes. Our school goals in AVID marry beautifully because if you are teaching at a high level, you're going to assess at a high level, which means your students are critically thinking at a high level. And that is the platform of AVID. And doing all those things will eventually allow students to get into college and stay in college. It's also a safe environment for the AVID kids to be in, just because like we do talk a lot about grades and that, that we're hard on each other, but it's a safe place to be on that. Like if you just need a mental breakdown one day, you're good to be an AVID because your classmates will help you through it. Your teachers are always willing to like help you and like set up meetings with your teachers or be like, okay, I need you to have this done by the next class. The nice part about AVID is it gives you some consistent language and consistent practice on making sure you personalize learning for students. Our hope is by utilizing intentional strategies that are there that our students are able to interact with it in multiple facets. And it's not just living or breathing in one set of curriculum, but it's living beyond the AVID elective that's there, but it's living in each of the core content areas and elective areas as well. So our goal is really to make sure our teachers are equipped to make sure they have the right tool at the right time to have the right impact for each student. I think the key for AVID is it's more of a, it's more of a philosophy. So from our perspective, it's, it's about getting kids kind of to the academic level that we think that they can be at. So if you're looking at key components, it's organization, it's positive peer relationships, having a support structure in place for those kids that's not just based on relationships with teachers, but also the peers that are with them, committed elective teachers, having consistency as far as tools and language um, throughout the building and within the classroom. So they can go and kind of go from classroom to classroom and still have some of those expectations in place. It's not just about the elective classroom, which is what's exciting about it. It can be for any kid. I would probably say how much it's changed me. From middle school, I was a really shy and quiet student that didn't really have the best of grades. And now coming into senior year, I've academic lettered twice, so I'm above 3.75 GPA. 
and I have a relationship with every single one of my teachers, which is really helpful for me because I do stress myself out a lot. So it's changed me as a person and not only like as a person, but also an academic standpoint as well. This is for those kids that are in the middle who are sometimes left out or they slip through the cracks. And it is to give them the tools to be more successful in school. These are maybe the kids that kind of they sit in your class and they do what they're supposed to do. But if they had that little extra push, they could just soar. And it's giving those students those strategies to be successful in class here at middle school, give them the strategies to then use in high school to be successful in college and beyond in the career. A lot of the growth that I am seeing in them is because of AVID. Their ability to communicate, their ability to ask questions, their ability to help each other learn. That's just really powerful. It's truly special to see these kids own their education and really own their future. My name is Hope Chapini and I'm a senior this year in AVID. AVID addresses the top things that colleges look for. Colleges look at your grades. AVID supports Cornell Notes and note taking to give students a basis for what note taking looks like and then students can then tailor to their own needs throughout the rest of the school years. Colleges also look for SAT scores and ACT scores. AVID addresses this with Khan Academy. Khan Academy partnered with College Board, which puts on the SAT. So Khan Academy has several SAT practice tests and several SAT problems geared towards the SAT that we were able to practice for several hours each week. Colleges also look at honors classes and AP courses. AVID addresses this with tutorials. Tutorials are when a student comes to class with a question and the peers are able to help answer the question and the student is able to understand the content. Colleges are also looking at extracurricular activities. AVID helps students with time management. My junior year, I had three AP classes, which I had never taken an AP class before, a zero hour with no off period, meaning I had an extra class than most of my peers. I had four honor societies, which I joined, with a total of 50 community service hours I needed to get done, on top of a part-time job. AVID helped me with my organization for all of this throughout my junior year. Colleges also look at a student's civic responsibility. AVID addresses the civic responsibility with high community involvement. Our senior year, we focus on a project that we find some spot in the community that needs help. We figure out how we can help the community and go on and help the community, like donating to a women's shelter. Colleges also look at how involved a student is in exploring colleges. Throughout our time in AVID, we visit colleges. In our junior and senior year, we're working on knowing how to apply for college, how to write the essay, and getting feedback on our essays. So when we turn it into the colleges, we feel the most confident that we could be when we apply to colleges. Hi, my name is Kayla Locke, and this is my AVID success. AVID has taught me many life skills, such as being comfortable with talking in front of my peers, having great organizational skills, as well as time management, and being able to get out of my comfort zone while being in class. AVID has pushed me not only to be a better hardworking student, but to become a better leader and a young person today. The AVID teachers are simply amazing and they deserve all the praise that they can get. If I would have never taken AVID, I would have struggled a lot over the course of my four years, and I am very thankful to be part of the AVID family. Now I would like to share Ty, a former AVID student's college success story. AVID helped me learn to use a planner, so now I use one every day in college. It also taught me how to take good notes, so now when I have a lecture in class, I can take and remember notes easily. AVID also taught me how to handle taxes and saving money for myself because as a college student, you tend to run out of money very fast. Hi, I'm Phoenix and I am an AVID senior. So what do we do in AVID? Well, in ninth grade, it's definitely more of a transition from middle school to high school. So we focus more on skills such as organization and communicating with your teachers. I know I personally needed help in the communicating with my teachers portion because I really struggled with doing that in middle school, but now I can confidently say that I can approach any teacher and ask them for help on any subject. This is also where tutorials are introduced and tutorials are a huge part of the AVID program. We do them from 9th to 11th grade with senior year being the year that we focus more on being a tutor for those in tutorials. And just a quick rundown, tutorials are basically a college study group where students help each other work through a problem without directly giving them the answer. Essentially, they help each other find the steps that they need to understand in order to solve a problem. 
Tenth grade, we focus a lot more on advocating for ourselves. I don't personally remember any assignment in tenth grade, at least for AVID, where I wasn't the one who had to be accountable for myself for the assignment. Organization also plays a big role in tenth grade as well with the binders, grade checks, and planners. This is also where we begin exploring what careers we want to go into through stuff such as job shadowing and exploring different careers that we might want to go into or didn't consider before. Public speaking is also a big part of this grade level in the sense that we learn how to make a presentation that's appealing to both the eye, but then the presentee can present it in a confident manner. 11th grade is a big year for any high school student and AVID helps focus those in 11th grade with the SAT. We do a lot of SAT prep and I believe we spend about two hours every week just working on Khan Academy to help us prepare for the SAT. And I can personally say with the skills that I learned through AVID, specifically focusing on the SAT, my SAT score improved over 100 points. This is also where we begin focusing on college. We begin writing college essays, applying for scholarships, and narrowing down our college search to our top five colleges that we might want to attend. 12th grade is more of a transition from high school to college and high school to being an adult. This is where we send out those acceptance letters to colleges as well as applying to scholarships that we think we would benefit from. This is also where we basically learn how to adult. Our adulting unit is our financial literacy unit. We learn a lot about interest, car loans, credit, debit, as well as how to manage our money in a way that can help us prevent from going into debt in the future. 12th grade is also a big part of where seniors become leaders, not only in the AVID program, but also in their community. As seen below in the bottom left corner of the slides presentation, this group of boys went out into the community and helped build homes for the Parker Core knowledge. That's just one example of like the community involvement that we focus on in AVID. We essentially try to find a problem in our community and we try to fix it. And again, seniors just kind of become the leaders in the AVID program by being tutors. Hi, my name is Brianna Garrett and I'm an AVID senior this year. Today I'd like to share with you some AVID quotes from our AVID seniors this year. First we have Blake. He says, it has given me a solid foundation and tools that will set me up for success in college and life. Next we have a quote from Jess. She says, it has motivated me to do well in school and I always felt that I was welcome there. And last we have a quote from Kaylee. She says, AVID has helped me gain confidence and given me organizational and study skills that I can use for the rest of my life. You might be asking what an AVID student is. An AVID student can really be anybody at Legend High School. We are looking for struggling students who might struggle in school but just need that motivation and that extra push to help get them going. Busy students can also be part of the AVID family. Busy students who have extracurriculars outside or work or things like that outside of AVID and school. We are also looking for students who want to excel academically and socially in our AVID program. We also are looking for unorganized students who need the help in order to be better in school and who need the push in order to make themselves more organized in keeping everything together for their high school career. We're also looking for AP level students and honor level students who enjoy challenging themselves and having the motivation in order to do better in school. And we're also looking for students who need help self-advocating, as well as those students who already can and just need the support from our staff and teachers. And AVID will provide you the skills to self-advocate. So who are we looking for? We're looking for those students in the middle who possess a desire to go to college, who work hard but need a little bit more support academically, socially or emotionally, and harness their full potential. Individual determination is the key to successful AVID student. If you feel like you're an AVID candidate and are interested in learning more about AVID, please go to the link below and sign up for one of our shadow days. Our online application is now available on the Legend website under Academic Programs. Thank you for your time and we look forward to meeting you.